Have you ever tried looking up a 3D model or an asset and you thought to yourself, I really wish there was a search engine dedicated specifically to 3D assets where I can just input an image, a drawing or description and get exactly what I'm looking for. Well, you guessed it. Today we're gonna take a look at a search engine designed for 3D assets. Scout from Asset or AI is an AI powered search engine that can transform the way you search for 3D assets. And from what I can see, it is designed specifically for 3D artists, architects, VFX artists, and even game developers. So basically, anyone working on a project that requires 3D assets. Scout is described as the AI-powered search engine for finding 3D models by picture across 3D stock marketplaces. Now, that's a long string of words, but essentially, this is a way for artists like you to look for, organize, index, and get access to assets all around the internet. For instance, say you are making an interior design, and you need a specific table that can go really well with the interior. First of all, you can go to Google and describe what you need and click through a dozen websites until you can find something that you think is suitable for your scene. Or two, you can upload an image of one piece of furniture that you will need. And Scout will scour the internet, searching for all major 3D websites and 3D stores for the exact replica of that asset, if there is one of course. Or you will find something pretty similar. The great thing is that the image does not have to be real or a 3D render. It can just be also a 2D sketch. Actually talking about sketches, this can be really great for concepting. So, say you have a concept for an asset like a chair or a monster, you can actually upload that black and white sketch, I mean upload it to Scout, and let the AI take a shot at finding the model that looks similar to the one that you sketched. Now, the search functionality is really good, and it hits way more than it misses, but even if the assets aren't a 100% one-to-one replica of the one that you're going for, they won't stray far from the reference. So Scout is one tool, but Assetto as a whole is an online platform or an application that allows you to create, store and manage 3D assets through your browser. And if you are in the internet for these kinds of applications and services which they provide, you can check them out from the link down below. But what I am interested here, I mean interested in talking about, is Scout. Now you know what Scout does, but there are more features that can make your life way easier when using Scout. First is the assembler mode. Flipping this switch will prompt the search engine to try and find assets that the image can be assembled from, like building blocks. So say you need all the assets in a certain image or render instead of looking for one asset. Flipping this switch, the AI will try to decipher each asset in the picture and provide each one in the results. Now, Scout will put the assets from all the famous 3D asset stores like CG Trader, 3D Sky, Quixel Megascans, 3D Export, 3D Buy, and more. And the list is ever expanding. And because all of these websites are already indexed, you can get all the results in mere seconds. And you can further filter results by choosing which websites you want to include in the results, and you can even filter only free assets, which is great. And now, the only assets are visible are gonna be completely free. You can also create favorite lists. So if you like a model or an asset, and you want to organize them into a list, you can do that by clicking the heart icon next to any asset. And if you hover over any search result, you will see where it is pulled from. Like this gun model from CG Trader, you can also see that it is a paid asset. And you can copy the link directly from there. And the favorite button is right here. Clicking the favorite button will invoke this window where you can create multiple lists by typing a name in the field and clicking the plus icon. And by the way, you can create as many lists as you want. Now that we know what Scout is and how to use it, I want to talk about something important, which is the free asset filter. And this one is only available for premium users. So if you are hoping to use this for free, I mean the asset finder, well, you need to pay at least $1. I just feel like this one would be much more popular if it is provided for free. I think they can keep the number of searches just by unlocking the free only filter and the tool would be much more popular. But hey, this is just my opinion. And now it is a good time to talk about pricing. The pricing for a scout is really simple and super affordable in my opinion. It goes from $1 a day to $5 per month to $100 per year. 
That is if you want to pay yearly. And the pro plan is by far the most popular with $10 per month, giving you unlimited searches, access to favorite lists, and the ability to share them. Last but not least is a submission feature where you can submit specific stocks that you think should be added in the scout index by linking to the stock page and clicking the plus icon right here. This is one of the ways that you can contribute to the software by expanding its library. I myself did the sensible thing by linking my own assets. So generally speaking, Scout is a search engine for 3D artists and artists in general, and it can save you a ton of time and headaches. So basically, you can run through hundreds of assets in mere seconds and help yourself finish your work fast. So if you are interested, click the link down in the description and try Scout for free. And let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. I hope you guys found this video useful and informative. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. You can also check some of our previous videos. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in the next one.